History was made in the NBA this month when assistant coach Becky Hammond was named head coach of the San Antonio Spurs Summer League team. She has coached five games and won four. But as Carter Evans reports, more than victories, Coach Hammond is earning respect. As Becky Hammond paces the sideline, she is fully in charge, but also feeling the weight of history. This is just kind of throwing me into the fire a little bit. Um, and you'll either melt or it'll make you harder and stronger like gold. Hammond has been constantly proving herself. Out of college, every WNBA team passed on her. You got to be persistent and resilient, and whether it be people not drafting me, trading me, people telling me I'm not good enough to be on their team. She eventually convinced teams to give her a tryout and went on to become a seven-time All-Star in the WNBA. Hammond, who's five foot six, always held her ground. Is all of that resistance that you pushed through? Is that what made you who you are? I wouldn't change it in any of it. Me tearing my ACL landed me in the film room of the Spurs. Spurs coach Greg Popovich knew all about Hammond, who played eight years in San Antonio. They often discussed basketball strategy. Last year, Popovich named her assistant coach, the first woman ever to hold that title. Now she's the team's summer league head coach. It takes some courageous men to hand women opportunities. You know, everybody's talking about me being the first. Well, Greg Popovich handed me this hammer to kind of smash this glass ceiling. The NBA Summer League is where rookies and veterans try to prove their value. Same with the coaches. What does it take to be a good coach? You have to get people to, to, to buy in that you do know what you're talking about. Hammond admits to being nervous. Honestly, coming in, I, that was probably one of my biggest questions is, you know, are these guys going to respect me? <laughs> Rookie point guard Shannon Scott quickly put that concern to rest. She had a great mind. She knows what she wants out of her players, and she's very straightforward about it. I believe that she's shown that she's a great basketball coach, and I think everybody will start to realize that now. Hammond says her biggest satisfaction will come when people drop the label first female coach and just call her coach. I don't want to downplay the significance of it because it is a big deal. I get that, but I also want it to be known that I was hired because I was qualified. Her actions on the court speak for themselves. Carter Evans, CBS News, Las Vegas.